alongside Craig Anthony and Clark Kellogg. For the Memphis Grizzlies, they won their last contest that game against the Cleveland Cavaliers. And there wasn't much question as to how that game was going to turn out. They absolutely put the hammer down on them. Yeah, I love the way they just came right out at them in that game, determined to attack the rim. And when that strategy, Greg, didn't lead to layups, they usually wound up at the foul line. And I thought they shot an excellent percentage when they did get to the line. Now we'll look at Memphis's starting group. Green is the three with Zebo at the four. Conley and Allen in the backcourt. And it's Gasol and at the pivot, manning the middle. Memphis known for how tough they are at home, but they were equally tough, Clark, on the road last season. Yeah, grit and grind. Yeah, guys, and once they got spiraling downward, uh, there seemed to be no way to get out of it. All their offense went to pop. Now the starting group for the visitors. Lavoy Allen out there with Hill. Then it's George Hill, then it's Paul George, and it's Ellis and at the two spot. Oh, for Jordan Hill, something wonderful happened to him last season. The breakthrough he'd been waiting for on his sixth year. Yeah, Kevin, you know, it had to do, and I think correlated with him getting a chance to start games, and it blew up for him from there. Posted career high averages across the board. And that one's good. Here's Jackson. Here's Caldwell Pope. They set the screen. It's Drummond with the drive. Off to a good start as he hits his first shot attempt. Oh, that is just weak defense there. I'm pretty sure that was not the plan to give him those kind of baskets at the hoop. Pick up by Hill. Allen right side. George, that's a two-pointer. Hit some rim on the way in, and the bucket's good. George has got his second.